All right, 4.15 a.m. This is the original circuit, which is the uh, uh, op amp ADC, wait, wait, DAC. And here we have the uh, buffer bypass, I believe it's called, with two BJTs and a bunch of switches, well, actually just one switch. And as of right now, <clears throat> We have the input signal coming from the guitar here, and it goes through the op amp, so it gets centered around 2.5 volts, and the output of that goes here to the first port of the uh, the buffer on one side of the BJT, and the middle port gets sent to the analog input of the microcontroller. Oh, last but not least, we have this input signal being processed by the microcontroller, then processed by the um, the DAC, and this output goes here, which will be connected to the third and final port of the buffer. So as of right now, the only thing that's connected is the guitar itself to port 1, and port 2 connected to the analog input of the microcontroller. So all we will see in one mode of the switch will be the pure signal from the guitar. Nothing from the other one. If we switch the, uh, put the switch to the pure mode, which I just did, you should see it from both. So they're both wiggling around. The reason I did this is so that we can see as soon as I attach the output of the DAC to port 3, then in this mode, you should see the process signal, which will look the exact same, unfortunately. But here we have a working buffer bypass. Amen.